Mr. Wang. Hi, I'm Catherine. My friends and I are designing a travel brochure for a trip into space, but we need to learn more about future space travel. Well, Catherine, you've come to the right place. Welcome to Starship 2040. Thanks. Do you really think there will be tourists in space? Yes, and probably in your lifetime. Every day, scientists, engineers, and highly trained people are working to make space travel a reality. In the next 40 years, we're looking at vacationing, working, and even living in space. Wow, that would be awesome. So how do you travel in space? With systems like this. This is a navigation and vehicle health monitoring system. Crew will need to access information like this throughout the ship. That makes sense. This isn't what I think it is, is it? Yes, it is, but it is modified. It's more than likely that your ship won't have any gravity. So therefore, the bathrooms will have to be changed so you can wash your hands, brush your teeth, or even take a shower. Is this the toilet? Yes, and you must remember the phrase, always buckle up. This is really important in using the bathroom in space, because if you don't, a really big mess can happen. We don't want that. Using the bathroom will be kind of weird. Yes, and of course, after you finish using the restroom, you need to wash your hands, so you can use this washing facility. Why are there chairs on the ceiling? That's simple. When traveling in low gravity, every floor can be a ceiling and every wall can be a floor. You float from deck to deck. I would have a great time floating around, but what else can you do for fun? Well, you have your own personal entertainment center. You can watch movies, play games, or even surf the space net. Or one day you can even talk to your friends face to face. That sounds like my kind of travel. We learn in the case of the biological biosphere how important it is to exercise. Do you have any exercise equipment for space travel? We sure do. Without gravity, the human body gets lazy. Today's fittest astronauts even have to exercise at least two hours to stay in shape. We have a stair stepper, a climbing wall, and a treadmill that you can stay in shape with while you're in space. How do you eat while traveling in space? Well, the Starship has a self-serving kitchen. You pre-select your meals before you go on your trip, and once you're hungry, you dial them up, and they're prepared just the way you like them. Wow, this trip will be so cool. I can't wait to the year 2040. Thanks, Mr. Wang, for all your help. You're welcome. Send me a copy of your travel brochure when you're done. We might just want to use it one day.